In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can add, rig, and animate a door in Blender. It's going to be quick and easy, so uh, let's get started. Okay, so let's press A, then X to delete everything in the scene. And then we're going to go up to Edit, Preferences, and then we're going to use a free add-on that's included in Blender. So just search Arc, and then let's uh, select Arc Mesh. And then you can press Shift A, and then we can add a uh, door. And then next, we're going to rig the door. And we're going to rig it by using an empty. And uh, the empty is going to rotate this door on the z-axis. And the handle on the y-axis. Okay, so press Shift A. And then go to empty. We're going to use an empty cube. You can of course use the other types of empties as well. And then press S to scale it down. And then we're going to use some drivers to control the rotations with the location of the cube. So let's right click on the Y rotation for the handle, add driver. And then we're going to set it as a negative expression. And then for the object, we're going to select the empty. And then when the empty moves on the z-axis, it's going to rotate the handle on the y-axis. So press G, then set, and the handle rotates on the y-axis. And we can limit the rotation by adding a constraint to the empty. So let's limit the location. And then uh, let's set the maximum to zero and the minimum to however far we want to rotate the uh, handle. So let's set it around here, which is about minus 0.5. So let's type in minus 0.5. And as you can see, we now can't rotate it any further. And then we'll do the same for the door. This time it's going to be the uh, set axis rotation at the driver and once again we're going to use a negative expression so that it goes the right way and then for the object we're going to choose the empty and then we'll control it on the y location so that when we move the empty on the y axis it's going to rotate the door on the z axis we can also add a constraint to the y axis of the uh, empty as well, so that there's a limit to how much we can rotate the uh, door using the empty. So uh, by using an empty, we're able to control both the rotation of the handle and the rotation of the door at the same time. And uh, this makes it very easy to animate. So uh, let's add some keyframes. Press I to keyframe. We can go a few frames forward, and then I can press G, and then set to grab it on the z-axis, and then press I to keyframe. And then we can move the empty backwards on the uh, y-axis. So let's move a few frames forward, and then press G, then Y. And then we can also move it upwards so that the handle goes back to the original rotation. And I press I to keyframe. As you can see, we now have a uh, door opening animation. 